Hi all. In this video, we will discuss how to define a form loop in ODO 15. So let us see what is a form loop in ODO. As we know, inside this sales module, the very first view we see is the tree view. Upon clicking a record, we get its corresponding form view. So this is a form view in ODO. So let us see how we can define a similar form view in our custom module. So inside the PyCharm, this is my model vehicle.render and I have few fields defined inside this model. Now the corresponding view, I have defined a record inside the model ir.ui.view for the model vehicle.render and gave name for the field. Now inside the form tag, we add all our required fields to be displayed inside the form view and here at first we define the header and inside the header we mention the state field which is normally aligned on the top of the view and in the middle we add the sheet so that it will give a particular background for the fields and inside the sheet we add the groups so that all the fields will be aligned properly in the view and we mention all the required fields defined in the model so that they will be available or uh, will be displayed in the front end. Now in the action window for the corresponding model that is we have added a new record for the more inside the model ir.actions.act window. Here we have mentioned the view modes such as tree, form. We mention all the required views that are defined so that they will be available in the front end. So only if I'm defining Kanban, that must be defined in the view. Unless we define it in given error. So similarly, we define tree and form. So upon running this, I'm upgrading my model, vehicle render. Now here you can see in the tree view, I have one record. Now when I open that, here we can see the corresponding form view for that record. This was the header defined field state. So this is how we define a form view for a module in Odoo 15. For any support or queries, please contact info at cybrosis.com. Thank you.